first we have the Deep, obviously the main vehicle I post. Um, did a walk around when I first started uploading videos. So there's not much that's changed. Um, one, this is a bumper that me and my buddy built. It's two by six tubing. Uh, it's pretty thick, I forgot the size. These are two by two, two of them welded together. Um, this piece is actually off of a tire carrier for a Humvee I got from my old motor pool when they're cleaning out stuff. Um, these are shackles I took for the motor pool. They're kind of oversized. Like I said, they all, I was able to get it. I didn't just take it. Um, high lift mounted to the bumper. Financial mistake, because it is. No, I'm just kidding, I love this thing. Um, 38, I've been off road with it. It supports the weight of the 38. Um, got this Lund wind jammer. These are hard to find. Um, this one I found off of Facebook. Um, and then dude sent it to me, paid him really good deal. Well, I got a really good deal, so I just paid him, he sent it. Um, DBM armor, took a flop. I got a video of that. Um, of course, the 38 Milestar Patagonia MT01s. I don't even know if it's called MT01s, but these are originals, not the new ones. Battleborn B blocks. Uh, got the rock sliders me and my buddy built. As you can see, they are used pretty good. I got a front track bar bracket that pushes it forward. Um, dual rate, metal cloak, four and a half TJ springs with the ACOS adjustable coil spacer. I did custom sway bar brackets that I need to redo because they kind of, they bend a little bit. Um, hydro, hydro assist by PCS, stock box. Regular diff cover, front and rear, rough country, long arms, 513 gears, lockers, front and rear, custom steering, WJ knuckles, a Smitty built, 9,500 pound winch, eBay lights, eBay lights, all my lights are on eBay, um, eBay vents, they're styled after like a 2013 14 Mustang. I think, um, oh yeah, and a custom front bumper that I built for actually my old Jeep and I just moved it onto this one. Has a hitch mount up front, covered by this. And yeah, I mean, interior. Pretty much nothing to it. Just, uh, Doubled in radio, subwoofer, and some of my stuff inside. Nothing too much. No, and WeatherTech rain guards. Got those for a hundred bucks off eBay. Got lucky as well. Oh, and then Billistein, Billistein, I don't know proper way to say it, but shocks all the way around. Oh, yeah. And this. This swings out. Let me see. Probably got junk back here. Oh yeah, just my subwoofer and my tool cases. Once for tools, once for ratchet straps. Now for the truck, it's gonna be easy. Truck's pretty much stock. Um, it's 35s with the leveling kit. Uh, has LED headlights, LED fog lights. I mean, you know, factory, factory went, 410 gear ratio, lockers front and rear, di uh, automatic, well not automatic, uh, sway bar disconnect button inside. Uh, let's see. Oh. 
only thing I really added is two 10 inch subs. Truck is fully loaded, sunroof, heated cold seats, um, camera pointed right into the bed. Yeah, but this is pretty much stock, just leveled on 35s. That's it, nothing fancy. And then, got one more. Here we go. I was gonna say my favorite, but kinda like the Jeep a little more. But it's my 91 300 ZX twin turbo. Um, all original, I did put the lip on it. It's all white underneath there. I need to get the lip painted. Plan on doing side skirts, rear diffuser. Um, it does have a slight miss. One of my injectors are going bad, so I got bigger injectors inside. Let's see. Wrong way. Same thing like the Jeep, doubled in. I got some junk in here, but 110. Here are my 550cc injectors with the 550 chip. Like I said, I got some junk in here. But yeah, just 110 and underneath the seat. And yeah, that was a quick walk around. Oh yeah, forgot. This car has full bolt-ons, bigger intercooler, boost is turned up to 10 PSI. Um, yeah, that's it. Oh, and then my trailer that I need to put wood on because the wood's going bad. And then the removable fenders I made that I damaged, I need to paint those.